Hi, this is PR Sundar. Welcome to Post Market Report sponsored by Delta Dot Exchange. Uh, we are still having some technical problem, so that's why only the podcast for next few days. And the markets consolidated ahead of Fed meet, and uh, we would say this is a calm before storm. Surprisingly, the volatility index started moving higher. So yesterday also the VIX was higher when the market went up. Today also VIX was higher when the market going down. Uh, but nothing to worry much because you know all these VIX shooting up is because of Fed meet. So once that event is over today, tomorrow, uh, irrespective of market goes up or down, the VIX is likely to come down as the Fed uh, meeting will be over. So that event will be over. And today, uh, Bank Nifty underperformed, but uh, Reliance and HDFC twins supported the market. In the morning, I said Maruti and Hiromoto may come under selling pressure because of uh, not so good monthly auto sales data so maruti fell drastically i think maruti now it has fallen about 400 rupees from recent high the high hit was uh, due to good corporate result now everything is being wiped out so metal index surprisingly did very well and particularly vedanta so it was just trading around 280 rupees one or two days before now it gone to close to 300 rupees uh, vedanta uh, going up, you know, it was really surprising because they came out with a bad set of results. Not only Vedanta, I think all the metal companies came out with very bad results. But despite that, uh, Vedanta is doing really very well. So maybe that may have to do with the uh, US dollar index and this and that. Anyway, we have to wait uh, for one more day. Markets, uh, you know, uh, came under selling pressure. Uh, that is because probably today is the first day the domestic institutions decided to sell aggressively. FIAs have bought for 1,436 crores, but uh, domestic institutions have almost equally sold. So they've sold for 1,378 crores. And moreover, people wanted to book profits ahead of the US Fed event because we don't know what is going to happen. Although the chances are very high, you know, Fed chairman may speak uh, dovish, but you know, you can never trust the US markets, at least for the last one year. So that is what is happening. Looking at the open interest, there was some unwinding in the puts and there's some huge addition in call options. So people are uh, turning slightly bearish. But anyway, all these of no use. There's no point in discussing all this uh, data ahead of tomorrow's Fed meeting. Today, the private sector jobs data, the ADP jobs data came the data was better than expected. So as I always say, a better economic data is not good for stock market. So the US futures uh, started falling after this jobs data and uh, US job market is still seems to be resilient as per the data which came yesterday also and today also. But US futures are just struggling. But today, one thing is very sure, US markets will be very, very volatile. Going forward, so if the Nifty has to take out all time high, that should come only from four stocks. That is HDFC, HDFC Bank, TCS and Infosys. And today TCS and Infosys both came under good selling pressure. So that's because of Nasdaq falling yesterday. And there is nothing much to talk today because of the Fed meeting. So, you know, there are only three things which are important for tomorrow's market. One is US Fed meet. Second and third also US Fed meet only. We will see tomorrow morning. Hope you enjoyed listening to this audio. Thank you for listening.